All right, everyone. So this is going to be my last thing on Georgia. Um, honestly, there's a lot that goes into this, what I'm going to talk about really quick uh, with uh, pebble votes and inactive voters and everything. There's three categories of voters and you can get back on the list of active and whatnot. So, but uh, really quick. So no one seems to be talking about this. It's in the Georgia State Constitution. Paragraph 2, Article 2, uh, for runoffs, it says a runoff election shall be a continuation of the general election and only persons who were entitled to vote in the general election shall be entitled to vote therein. And only those votes count. Now, it, it leaves, it's open to interpretation, um, the general election deal, if it meant does it mean it's only in the state? I mean, this is the state constitution. So, and according to this, the recent Supreme Court ruling, since they ruled they don't want to get in the way of what the states dictate, then this has to stand. So if anyone actually did move there just to vote, well, I would think that your vote should not be counted because you were not eligible to vote in the general election in Georgia. So, uh, that's how I look at it. And I mean, that's, it's the law. So, but, uh, people don't care about the law when it benefits Dem Democrats. And you got to remember, these are the same people complaining about when the police break the law that they're sworn to protect and uphold and nothing happens to them. Well, don't be complaining about the, when the police break the law and get away with it, but yet people vote in an election illegally and get away with it. So there's such a double standard in this country. It's fucking ridiculous. But uh, we'll see if this comes into play or not. Like I said, there's a lot that goes into it. I have not looked at the voter list in Georgia. And honestly, I'm probably not going to because the fact that no one's talking about this, especially like I hate Fox, but you would think conservative news outlets would be mentioning this. And they aren't. And I haven't even seen any of the shady conservative news outlets on Parler even mention this thing. So, and everything gets talked about on Parler. It's so fucking stupid and hilarious. So, if Parler isn't talking about this, then there's got to be a reason for it. And that's just suppress it. 